Maybe if you dive in the penalty area mm. to try and con a penalty, mm. could that be a red card offence? I want to briefly talk about whether or not simulation warrants an actual red card instead of the yellow. It depends, boy. There's a difference between simulation and just blatant diving, bruv. You know what I mean? Like Mo Salah, about chicken tikka Mo Salah. They even got a song about it. <laughs> Salah, Salah, diving down the wing. Salah, Salah. The ref don't do Where a do thing, bruv. Real talk. I've heard them singing that. They, they glorify the diving. Don't get me wrong. Football's it's a short sport. Like, it's a short career. So if someone's hit you, go over, roll over. In all fairness, though, I think that a lot of it, it's like a very fine line between contact and it being a foul, contact being a dive. Obviously, VR, I don't think it's ready like, yet, maybe, but that's where it needs to be looked at. Like, maybe if you dive in the penalty area mm. to try and con a penalty, mm. could that be a red card offence? Because you're trying to win your team a penalty. Yeah, real talk. Which is, you know, an easy way to score a goal. If it's on the pitch anywhere else outside the box, mm. yeah, yellow card, you can accumulate two from diving. The Premier League were thinking about introducing an orange car system. I think that was really like frowned upon at first. Orange Is that card? the sin bin? The sin bin yeah. idea. Like, I think not only would that help reduce it, because you have one of your best players could be off the pitch, it wouldn't just help to stop the diving, but it could make it a bit more entertaining. In... Yeah, but I think that's just too much rules for football. Like, how's like a man, like you've seen Phil Jones, how's he going to understand what but sin bin But there's been times where you're in... He hardly knows what he's yeah, doing no, no, but it's like You're in between whether it's, it's a dive or a foul. There's that in between, that grey area sometimes. Mm. That could be a way to stop that. I do think that we've got to do something because it's ruining the integrity of the game. Yeah. If you get kids who are growing up watching the likes of Deli Ali and Harry Kane representing the country, doing it at the highest level Champions League day in, day out, mm. it's going to filter through. We're going to end up with a bunch of people who are conning it themselves into better positions or getting penalties when it's... it's dirty. It'll just become a dirty think... game. OK, little hypothetical scenario for you. 90th minute of the game, you're playing against your arch rivals. Mm. Your guy goes down very easily. It's basically a dive. Mm -hmm. Are you taking that win home and celebrating, yeah, bantering all your mates off, or do you not want anything to do with that? Fam, I'll take that. Put that Every in my pocket. Day I'm going like, because I know for a fact that Harry Kane's putting that away, and I'm celebrating, bruv. I think if you're against your rivals, yeah. 100%, you want to see them suffer for something that's not a penalty. 100%. <laughs> it just like, it adds to the banter fire, doesn't it? You can just mm. be like, why not even a pen? And we still be uh, like. If I'm picturing Grealish in front of the old ten, 90 third man against Blues, mm. and step up, take this pen. <laughs> He's dived, which he doesn't die, so we're going to have to use a different player. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> hypothetically speaking, if that happened, I'm all over that. Come on, oh, I'm I'll take it. straight on social media to Blues fans, straight away. Are you going for a red card or not? Yes. Only in a box. No, I think there's too much of a grey area. Straight red card, four match ban. Two weeks' Four. wages, fines all round. Arsenal's team will be ruined if that happens. I like your defence is already gone, anyway. fam. You know what I mean? The <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to stir it up there, but you just stir it up to the green. No defence. Zero four two. That's Arsenal's formation next season. I guarantee it. Okay, for the definitive answer, we go to the only voice that matters. It's the fans. We're going to ask them whether they think it's red card for simulation diving or not.